Hello pen testers this is Puneet from Rapid Safeguard back again with another video and in this video we are going to talk about World Machines Challenge Lab the grabbing attack so in every weekend we have started the premium lab where people can try and solve the lab and uh, the lab is basically based on real time vulnerability and CVE exploits so if you are willing to learn and keep update yourself with the latest vulnerability and latest CV then check out our platform worldmachines.com and follow us on Twitter and Telegram channel. So let's get started without wasting your time. To access this lab, just visit worldmachines.com and create your account. So here we go and uh, let's click on the grabbing attack lab. So click on the lab access. And uh, here we have the lab is started. So it's basically uh, this simple HTML page and we need to figure out the what is the vulnerability. So let's uh, click on the bug shoot and click on the go and here is the simple HTML page. So here we have the uh, simple HTML page but the server version is mentioned over here. So this is the grabbing attack. So here we are going to uh, check uh, for the Apache 2.4.49 exploit and here we go. So we have the part traverser and remote code execution vulnerability. So in penetration testing world, we need to check each and everything. So here we have the server version and uh, we are able to get the exploit. So let's move on to the exploit part and let's say whether we are able to exploit or not. So here we have the curl command and type curl hyphen s and give the path as as mentioned in the exploit db. Give the hyphen d and give the echo. Uh, content type let's copy entire thing and change accordingly so sometimes we need to understand whether the uh, expert db expert is working or not so that this is not necessary every time the expert db will work so we need to uh, check with our manual approach so here we have given the host. So here it is host the weekend labs and uh, give the port 8080 hyphen uh, bin and give the etc pass wd. Let's uh, uh, and uh, give the enter. Okay. Just uh, check. So it is showing the 404 not found. So as I mentioned earlier, it's uh, not uh, necessary that uh, expert DB will work each and every time. So let's uh, uh, figure out another approach and uh, give the pass WD over here in, in the last part. It is showing the 400 bad request. Now let's move on to the GitHub. So I have already uploaded uh, the payload on GitHub account worldmachines.com where you can see the CV 2021-4773 and I have already uploaded a video and uh, Twitter. Uh, on Twitter I have already uploaded this payload. So let's uh, check uh, whether it is working or not. Uh, CGI bean, it's showing 404. Uh, 500 internal error. Now let's remove CGI bean and give the icons and etc pass WD. Bingo, here we go. So uh, we can read the part, we can see the part traverser vulnerability. Now Let's try with the remote code execution vulnerability. 
let's say bean hyphen asset and give the echo so data and echo give the id command it is blank uh, response we got so oh, let's uh, again blank response uh, what we can do we can uh, change uh, curl command id and here here we need to ch uh, check change with the cgi hyphen bin okay cgi hyphen bin hyphen bin and bingo so remote code execution vulnerability is also there so for the part browser vulnerability it's icon we need to pass and uh, for the remote code execution vulnerability cgi hyphen bin we need to pass so let's uh, pass the icon etc pass wd and click on go here we got the etc pass wd file so this is the part traverse the vulnerability and now we are going to remote code execution so bean asset and give the echo id command okay uh, this is the different response here we need to change the cgi hyphen bin okay okay we need to change the cgi hyphen bin so here change cgi hyphen bin click on go okay blank response okay let's check cgi hyphen bin data we have passed the id command and uh, okay cv assets i think this is the correct way okay this is the correct way let's uh, check check again and uh, we got the output so id command executed successfully now let's pass the ls command and ls command we can see the list of directory so let's uh, find out the uh, flag file okay so flag file we need to pass and uh, ls command so where the where file and ls so www is also there and here we go that uh, flag file is over here so let's uh, cat uh, flag.txt so here we got the uh, flag so vnm uh, we got, got the flag now let's submit this flag and uh, submit and bingo so this is all about the vulnerability the cv 2021-41773 where you can uh, leverage the part traverser and remote code execution vulnerability in apache 2.4.49 as i have mentioned and as i have created this lab so if you are interested uh, to learn the CV related labs, then check out our platform worldmachines.com where we create a labs basically based on the different CVs. And uh, if you are willing to learn the cybersecurity with real time vulnerabilities, check out our basic labs, the learning labs we call. So learning labs is basically based on real time vulnerabilities as well. So this is Thank you guys. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you like this video. If you like, like or share, talk like or share, talk Then share with your infosec friends. Subscribe our channel. Join our Telegram channel. Link is in description box. Thank you guys. Thanks for watching this video.